Hi, my name is Max Vanderpool with Generations Community Church right here in Nicholasville, Kentucky. We're looking for someone to help us with worship. We're hiring a paid part-time position, director of worship arts, worship leader, worship pastor. The, the title doesn't matter as much to us as what this role means. And there's a couple of parts. Part one is the music part, the part you might expect. And part two is the creative administrative part. So let me articulate that. We're looking for someone who can lead vocally with a guitar or a set of keys. But, but here, you're not doing that alone. There's a couple of guitar players in-house, a couple of bass players, a piano player, a drum player, vocalists, right? And so on any given Sunday, are we expecting you to carry every single song all by yourself? No, no, but that's the music part, rehearsing and, and planning and that kind of stuff. The second part is the creative administrative part. I'm looking for someone who will partner with me in designing and implementing worship services that help people encounter the living God together as a community. If I've got one beef about the American church, okay, just one beef, it's that we... It's like we've gone back to the Middle Ages and we've made church into this spectator thing where we come and we kind of hum along to the music and listen to the sermon and then we go home. I just think worship should be more participatory, more engaging, more involving all five senses. Over my shoulder is something we did a couple of seasons ago where we all got our hands wet with paint and we put our handprints on the canvas as just a way to tangibly express things in our hearts where we were saying, thank you, God. Hey, God, I'm grateful for. Success at Generations is when we can say of somebody, hey, I'm proud of you. And so in this role, success isn't, man, more and more people, and woo, worship was off the hook today, and it's not about that. It's about helping people encounter the living God together. We're relatively new here. For years, we were a portable church. We set up and teared down every single Sunday. We moved in here and got settled at Christmas of 2019, and then COVID hit. <laughs> so we're still figuring out what it is to have our own facility. I'm looking for somebody that would be willing to experiment and try new things. Sometimes that means we're going to come up with ideas and do things and, and it's just going to fly and connect with people and they're going to connect with God and it's, we're going to hear stories and then there's going to be things we try and it leaves the nest and pfft, it thuds on the ground. It's okay to fail here. So those are some things about us. When it comes to the music part, we're not married to a particular style. Bethel, Hillsong, hymns, 80s and 90s praise music, folk music, country music, it doesn't matter. Style can be as eclectic as the day is long. If you've connected with any part of this, if any part of this has got you thinking, okay, you know what, I, I think I'd like to have a conversation. I've got some questions. Reach out to me. If you've been uh, looking on or off, uh, you may recall that we were looking in June. Hey, didn't you make a video in June? Yep, made a video in June. And I thought with a pretty good deal of hubris that I could tie this up and hire this position before I left for a three-month sabbatical. <laughs> nope, didn't happen. So here I am with a dose of humility, reaching out to those of you in the greater Lexington area who might be looking. Maybe... You're the man or the woman that God has in mind for us. <clears throat> Again, if any part of this connects with you, reach out to me, max at g2c.net. And again, I'm with Generations Community Church right here in Nicholasville, Kentucky.